What's going on everybody? It's Pelfrey and uh, today's casual Friday. So on Fridays I usually dress down, but uh, it's probably kind of loud in here. I'm in my office at work. Um, I got a row of computers behind me and over on this side I got some switches. Um, so I, I work in IT um, for those that don't know. Um, so I'm a computer nerd Monday through Friday and whenever they call me in the evening, but that's what I do uh, for a job. But anyway, um, I want to give a huge shout out and huge thank you to um, everybody that subscribed to my channel this past weekend, um, the, uh, what was it, the 6th, 7th, and 8th of uh, January 2017, I crossed 1,000 subscribers and that is absolutely crazy to me, I never would have imagined that I would have 1,000 subscribers and um, it, it's, it's, it's very humbling. Uh, I've, I've produced a, a, a lot of content and tried to um, share my experiences with others and and hopefully um, you know help somebody along um, the way that I do things is by no means the gospel it's just how I prefer to do things and I you know I do a lot of research uh, before I dive in but I like to hopefully give uh, each and every one of you an informative video that will help you or make you think about things that you're doing um, in order to maybe do them um, better is really not a, the best description maybe more efficiently which is probably the if you look that up in the Webster's dictionary, dictionary it's probably the same thing but thank you so much for a thousand subscribers um, it's kind of interesting over the weekend I had a guy comment on one of my videos and he actually said, hey, I'm going to be your thousand subscriber. I'm assuming it's a guy. Sorry, you know, I, I, this may be male or female, so I should give that disclaimer. Um, but so thank you so much. It's, it's truly a blessing to me. Uh, it's, it's been a wild ride, and I'm looking forward to um, progressing even further in the hobby. So uh, for the last year, I've been into reef tanks for just over a year now. I've done pretty much hardware. Uh, type videos. You know, this is my third reef tank that I've set up in a year, and they they started off with the 27 gallon cube. Uh, didn't really like the footprint of the cube, so I went to the 20 gallon long, which was only a temporary tank for me anyway, until I decided on the tank that I wanted to go with, which is now the Red Sea Reefer 250. Uh, still love the tank. It is a, absolutely a, a gorgeous tank. It's a perfect tank for me. Um, at some point we'll see you know the, the sky's the limit in this hobby uh, along with the wallet you know you, you, it can get expensive very quickly um, so basically for 2017 my g overall goal is to get uh, fish and coral into the tank and grow it out and see what happens see what my system likes um, right now it's got a variation of um, uh, soft corals and a few hard corals and I'd really like to dive into the SBS corals just because of the difficulty, um, but I need to really see how my system reacts and can um, grow them and or keep them alive, but that's kind of where I'm shooting for uh, for 2017. I do have some hardware pieces that I'm thinking about changing out and upgrading on the uh, Red Sea Reefer, but those are going to come sometime later in the year. It's not a priority of mine. Right now the system is running. Um, I got everything set up pretty much the way that I need it set up to uh, have an efficient system. Um, there are a, a couple little tweaks that I need to work on, but uh, aside from that, I'm doing water changes uh, once every two weeks, just a five gallon water change once every two weeks um, because my, my parameters are sticking where they need to stay. Um, so I'm, I'm very excited for uh, 2017. I do plan to um, hopefully make a few road trips. I went to uh, Nashville, Tennessee this past weekend and visited uh, Aquatic Critter. Never been to that store before, but I've talked to some people that have, uh, that are in the Nashville area or have gone to Nashville to visit fish stores. And they said out of all the five or six stores, Aquatic Critter was the store to go to. So that video is going to be coming out maybe next week. I still need to finish editing the video. Um, I'll probably make a, a trip to Louisville and go to uh, Aquatica, which as you know, that's where uh, CJ goes. Uh, and buys all of his livestock from. And then uh, Premium Aquatics is about two and a half hours for me, so it's not the worst drive in the world. Um, so all in all, all of these places are uh, at least a two hour drive, no matter which direction I go in. Um, so I do plan on ordering 
probably primarily most of my livestock as far as corals are concerned uh, online just because um, I'm probably going to spend the minimum anyway and get free shipping and then I'll just pay the 15 or $20 to get it delivered on Saturday. Um, I do have a uh, local fish store that's about a five minute drive from me. Uh, they are setting up a coral table right now, so I'm very anxious and very excited to see um, what they plan to do with it. Um, they always get a, uh, a fish shipment in, so that's probably where I'll primarily get my fish from, just because I don't really have a way to quarantine fish, and if I was getting fish shipped in, I would prefer to put them in a quarantine system first. Let them uh, relax a little bit and not be stressed out before they go into a display tank. But that's kind of the uh, objective for 2017. Um, once again, thank you so much for a thousand subscribers. It, it just blows my mind still. I, I think right now I'm at uh, 1,006 maybe. Um, so it blows my mind that um, there's a thousand people that are subscribed to a small guy from Kentucky. But um, thank you so much. Um, if you have any uh, comments, suggestions, please leave them uh, below. Uh, you can always visit my, uh, visit my website, so it's pelfrey.net. I'll uh, update the website um, as often as I can. I have tweaked a few things on the website, and in 2017, I may go a different direction with it, um, but there's always content, and my most up-to-date uh, information or pictures of the tank. Um, I am active on multiple forums as far as uh, Reef Tank community. So you can check out some of my build threads on uh, Reef to Reef, Reef Central, Nano Reef, and Big Blue Reef. And then these these links are always in the description below. Um, as far as uh, the rest of 2017 is concerned, we'll just see where it takes us. I'm I'm very excited. Uh, I, I love creating content and putting it out there. Um, you know, there's there's ups and downs with the hobby, but it's always the challenge that that brings me back to it and. Um, you know, there's, uh, I usually get the same group of people uh, commenting on my videos, and I love it, and by all means, keep bringing the comments. But I'd like to see some comments from the people that are not as vocal or haven't said anything. Um, it just may, it might be saying, you know, hey, I'm here, um, and, you know, I respond to every single comment, uh, and I try to do that within um, a couple hours. And sometimes, it, especially on the weekends when I'm not as active online, it may be a couple days, but... I respond to every single comment. Um, so those that watch my video, if you have a channel that uh, I've not commented on or maybe I don't even know about, please leave it in the uh, comment section below. I would love to see it. I subscribe to a ton of different channels and it's it's mainly reef tanks, but there's some, some other odd men's that I'm interested in that I subscribe to. Um, but I'm always interested to hear what other people are doing. Um, you know, I could take your information tweak it for my uh, specific setup and you know go from there and you may be doing something that I've never even heard of you know there's so much stuff in this hobby that we just don't even know about yet um, I, I typically um, like to listen to videos on my way to and from work it's a 30 minute drive so if you got a 30 minute video that you're just sitting there rambling on about leave it in the description below or the, the comment section below I will watch it on my way home from work or to work one day um, aside from that, I'll go ahead and wrap this up. I'm, I'm coming up on nine minutes now. Again, thank you so much for the support. Thank you for the comments. Thank you for the suggestions. Thank you for helping me out. I could not have gotten here um, without the help of all of you guys. That's that's for sure. Um, so we'll see what 2017's uh, got in store for us. Hope everybody has a good weekend, and uh, we'll see you on the next one.